The 37th annual John Bear Grease Sled Dog Marathon kicked off today in Duluth. The racers will follow trails up the North Shore, eventually crossing the finish line in Grand Portage on Tuesday. No fans are allowed this year due to COVID-19, but KBJ CBS 3's Natalie Grant was at the starting line today and spoke to racers before they hit the trails. And there she goes! On your mark, get set, mush. Racers from across the U.S. gathered just north of Billy's Bar in Duluth on Sunday, ready to hit the trails for the 37th Bear Grease. It's different. It's quiet. The dogs are quieter, but it is a beautiful morning. A quieter scene with no spectators, a change that had to be made due to COVID. But race organizers say it was worth it for the show to go on. It has been a labor of love. And yesterday at the vet check, seeing the dogs and seeing how healthy they are and how happy they are just made it worth it. This year marks the first full sled dog marathon for 18-year-old Errol Wallen of Two Harbors. Growing up in a family of mushers, he's no stranger to the bear grease. I've dreamed about doing the marathon for 18 years now, and once it's... Um once I complete it, it's going to be a pretty awesome feeling. Wallen, who will be racing in a field that includes his mother, Colleen, says no fans makes things different, but adds an extra focus to the race. We are basically just focused on the race, and it's nice to have spectators, but at the same time, it's less distractions, and it's just more focusing in on the race. For 2019 marathon champions Blake and Jennifer Frecking, a fresh batch of snow and warmer temperatures could be a disadvantage with their Siberian Siberian Husky teams, which traditionally do well in colder weather. You can't win the race in this first leg, but you can certainly lose it. And on a warm day like today, it's certainly a factor. Hike, hike, hike. However, Frecking says they are not as much concerned with placement on the podium as they are with having a fun and healthy finish. We're looking to get down the trail with a happy, healthy team and, you know, in this heat, we're going to back off. We're going to let them just take, pick their own pace and get there comfortably. No matter the circumstance, everyone is just excited to have a slice of normal in a year of anything but as they race to Grand Portage and cross the finish line. It's going to be one of the best feelings ever. John Bearsbury Sled Dog Marathon, good luck. The Bear Grease 120 teams also started today in Duluth and will finish tomorrow morning. Marathon teams are expected to finish in Grand Portage sometime Tuesday. Stick with us as we bring you full coverage from the trails now until Wednesday.